and this is the energy vibration lesson for the Pisces yeah we're still going with the Pisces birthday readings for um, the year 2017 and this is for the Pisces from um, 12 until um, the 18 from 12 until the 18 okay so we're gonna check on that yes this is from the 12 12 until the 18th I was right okay alrighty um I want to say to each and every person thank you for being here thank you for being back this is the 11th week of the year 2018 uh, the week begins from um, uh, it is the week of hair it's a week of the fool this energy of the fool is a lot of people going on a new journey this is your year 2018 so if you are born on the 12th of March until the 12th of March until the um, 18th of March this is um, very very positive you are going to start a new beginning on your life and this is going to be very very positive okay so this is going to be good it's going to be extremely good so let's look what you guys have because there's a lot of strength because some of you are going to be on a new beginning so there's going to be a lot of strength you are going to be asking for inner strength because you're starting a new beginning um, um, some of you have to look in words and the wheel of fortune is coming for some people justice is coming for some people um, for some people your materialistic world is going to be good some people are going to have a lot of um, what uh, a lot of promotions new job opportunity and some people have to deal with organization so let's look why here's happening for everyone okay don't understand what is happening okay strange strange Calling up in the guides and angels for the Pisces to come in and show the message what needs to be um, be told. So this is going to be good. So let's go forward and see what messages is coming in for the Pisces in this week. Wonderful, mm, extremely wonderful. There's a lot of help, a lot of uh, help financial situation. So this is going to be good. Love is coming in okay so ladies and gentlemen for the people who were born on the 12 oh my god there's such a glare um you are going to have um to look inwards um in a strength um in a strength to you know accept this new beginning it's not going to be hard but you have to look within to find um, what is there listen to your intuition because the energy of the moon is in the reverse form and what it is saying is that you need to listen to your intuition your Pisces um, the universal angels and guides your supporting um, element people um, you know they're the one who helps you and um, what they're going to do for you this year is help you to understand how is it um, just um, they're going to teach you to listen to your intuition okay so this is good because um, you're going to learn something and uh, um, by doing that you're going to be extremely successful um, um, some of you are going to find yourself some of you are going to go with the um, go within and find the inner strength and find yourself and stand up um, to things and move forward and uh, you're not no longer going to be afraid because you're going to be understanding that the journey is for you to find inner strength and uh, um, so it says um, whoever that um, protects you on this planet at this time seen or unseen um, they are going to be helping you to move forward so this is good starting out um, the year at the end of the year you're going to feel yourself at a high vibration and some people are going to have success some people are going to have a lot of luck okay 
let's look at the people who were born on the 13th you have the energy of it's a spiritual year for you because what is happening is that the energy of the hermit is here so you are going to be looking inwards for inner wisdom and guidance inner wisdom and guidance it's a year where you're going to be learning um, to focus and understand your journey and your part in this lifetime and it's going to be good the um, five of cups um, you're not going to have any regrets moving forward you're going to accept um, uh, um, what it is um, no regrets you're going to be understanding by listening to your inner guides and wisdom you're going to be receiving um, solution to everything that you have so um, you know as this new journey begins and these obstacles begins you're going to be receiving solution to all the things all the situations that are coming up okay there is a lot of information a lot of talks um, a lot of praises is going to come your way and a lot of talks a lot of people are going to be look up to you um, you know really positive in a positive way um, you know whatever has transpired you need to release it and ask for healing and release it and move on we're moving to the people who were born on the 14th of March as we look at the people who were born on the 14th of March this is going to be a wonderful positive year it's going to be the year of the wheel of fortune wheel of fortune is, is, is whatever situation that you have been dealing with is great you're going to be leaving that behind and moving forward and looking forward um, to a new start and this new start is going to bring you wonderful um, a positive energy that is going to be coming in um, this is bringing like a lot of new um, situation so um, for people who are looking for work for people who are looking for um, new um, business endeavor for people who are looking for new relationship and that sort of a thing it's going to be a positive year for you um, a lot of people will be planting a lot of seeds and when I said planting a lot of seeds you will be um, you know finding the right people to start new business to start planning for study groups and that sort of a thing you're going to be connecting with the right organization is as if the wheel of fortune is going to bring you together with the right people and this is going to be very positive so it's going to be a good year um, for you people who were born on the 14th new people coming in your life new soulmates new wonderful experience as we look for the people who were born on the 15th we have the energy of justice okay and this is positive because um, the energy of justice is balancing out this doesn't have to be a legal situation it has to do with karmatic justice where um, you're dealing with people on this hurt plane who you came in and have contracts to deal with them with um, um, you know in different ways so um, what is happening is that if it's a legal situation and you have a, a lawsuit and that sort of a thing finally you're going to see the truth of it and money is going to be coming to you um, because um, um, it could be a situation that you weren't aware that people were having you in the ring and um, lying and that sort of a thing and um, you know um, this have to do with people who have worked with um, companies organization and groups of people and they were lying and that sort of a thing and they have brought um, you know a, a sort of a, a negative situation to your life and now um, you have won and you have won justice as prevail and you have won and these people have to um, pay you okay so this is good for another set of people it can be um, a situation that has happened in lifetime and lifetime before that someone has um, you know unjustly um, took money from you and that sort of a situation and now it is returning to you so it could be that um, there was an airfulness and there was you know uh, money that you should have received and um, it was withdrawn and or withhold from you from you or someone tried to steal it and it is now going to be returned to you so that is good for the people who were born on the 15th, happy birthday. This is going to be a wonderful year. Um, if you're looking for a new house, um, uh, new cars, new um, materialistic 
things new apartment um, you know looks vacation it's gonna be a situation so it's a status as if your um, whatever you need in life is just going to magically come in your life you know um, not you know not really magically but it's just gonna fall in place it's just as if you ask the universe and you ask the Empress for help for whatever you need and it, this is just going to be coming at you in this year which is good four of pentacles is there so a lot of people in this year is going to try and hold on to um whatever they have and make sure that you know everything is in balance in their life especially health health is going to if you were having health problems the last couple of um, years this is going to be um becoming very very much in balance where um you're going to be feeling much better about yourself this is all about stability and bringing stability so let's say you had a health situation for some time um, now you're going to be feeling well in this year what you're trying to do is at the same time hold on on your financial situation hold on hold the grounds um, and, and you know you are really 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 um, need to hold on to positive energies in your life and this is going to be the year to do that as we move forward we look at the energy for the people who were born on the 17th of March this is going to be good we have the energy of the Emperor the energy of the Emperor is wonderful because it could be a father figure or it could be someone who you're going to be coupling up with it, who is a Taurus or a Leo but in another sense it's going to be a lot of success for a lot of people okay there's going to be a lot of business success a lot of people coming together invitations coming to you from organization um, some people who are going to be finishing study and that sort of a thing you're going to be connecting with the right people and the right connection and this is going to be good for you because whatever is happening and whatever is transpiring you're going to see that um, wonderful situations and good situations are coming in for you so um, you're going to be um, someone is going to be inviting you out and um, or connecting with you and these are the areas for the, some people it's going to be the areas for some people it's going to be that you're going to find the right um, as someone in authority for some of you are going to be connecting with you um, to either do business with you or um, you know um, that you're going to be working with them and this is going to be good because this is going to be um, very positive and bring a lot of success in some of your your lives so uh, different people different strokes different folks and um, different things are going to be happening for you but whatever is going to transpire in your life it's going to be good okay as we look at the people who were born on the 18 happy birthday this is a new year this is the year 2000 and 18 and you are going to be having the to, to work with a lot of people a lot of situation organization and that sort of a thing so a lot of people um, you're going to be clearing karmas with a lot of people um, insurance company telephone companies you name it whatever huge organization for some people who works um, in huge corporations and that sort of a thing um, some people will be finding their way being called in call centers or um, uh, some people are going to find themselves working more for the public or uh, who you know you're going to be bringing in alien energies for these people just by um, communicating with them so it's going to be a very good year um, this is going to be wonderful the Queen of Swords have a situation with an organization um, and some of you are going to be dealing with this Queen of Swords okay um, whatever the situation is whatever is transpiring and whatever that has happened whoever the Queen of Swords in the organization is um, whatever the situation is is that um, the energy of the um, love is here this person um, is going to be connecting with you and show you love in a positive way okay so um, it's as if someone from out of an organization is going to be really connecting with you and showing you love and this is going to be good so expect that to be coming up and this person is also going to find a solution to whatever the situation is okay so someone from out of an organization is going to be connecting with you guys and it's going to be showing love I should say for you guys it's going to be a wonderful year it's going to be a good year it's going to be a year 
where there are going to be a lot of situation that is happening a lot of situation that is going to be transpiring and that sort of a thing in your life and what is going to be happening is that um, positive energies is going to be coming up in a different ways in different situation whatever um, is going to transpire in your life is going to be in a positive way in this year especially for you guys who were born in this week okay because um, the energy of the Sun um, is always the energy of positive energies coming in okay and the energy of the Sun good conversation there's going to be good conversation um, great um, connection great communication that is going to be happening and this is going to be good so um, um, this is wonderful because um, you Pisces are always very good um, you can communicate very good whenever um, that is coming up and um, what is happening is that you are going to be talking with a lot of friends connecting with new people coming in your life and this is going to be good um, there is going to be a lot of um, people who are going to be coming in to help you financially and this is going to be wonderful because um, whatever the situation business partner new business partner financial success is going to come to a lot of you okay um, what else is that if your financial situation was a little bit out of balance you're going to have strong um, you're going to build your business or um, if you are self-employed you're going to build your business in this year it's going to be good it's going to be wonderful it's going to be um, extremely extremely positive if you were looking for new promotion new work new jobs new um, creative situation in your life this is also going to be happening for you there is going to be an invitation for a lot of you um, and this invitation is going to be good it's going to be positive because what is going to happen and what is going to be transpiring is that new doors of opportunities are going to be happening for you what else is going to be happening is that most of you some of you if you have twin flame or soulmates um, you're going to be meeting someone and um, you could be meeting this person at a party or you could be meeting this person um, if you go out you could be meeting this person but some of you are going to be really meeting someone who's going to um, play a significant role in your life which is going to be extremely extremely positive so this is good okay let's see um, what are the messages the Oracle the wisdom of the oracles have for you Pisces isn't this wonderful a change in the wind and this is so positive because this is the energy of the fool and a change in the world whenever the energy of a change in the wind comes up it is a positive um, change because we need to make changes in our lives and um, it is a year of new journeys so <laughs> um, my guardian angels have been bringing up just you know really really wonderful things so um, a change in the wind is um, you know a sense of uh, that unseen changes has been eliminated prepare for a storm or awareness that your plans may be not good feeling a shift on self uncertainty it's always you know human but whenever changes are coming in our life but is it good or is it bad whenever changes are coming in this is how we feel so we need not to worry about this okay it is you know with relationships there are going to be changes in relationship there could be people who are um, breaking up people who are ending relationships that sort of a thing um, the world is constantly in change and people are constant in, in change life is about getting interested okay so you need to understand that the unknown is where the magic lies and this is what you guys should hold the unknown is where the magic lies and this is going to be wonderful ladies and gentlemen I want to thank you for being here and thank you for being back and I want to say to each and every person namaste until next week please like share these videos thumbs up and uh, um, and I will speak to you next week